In this age of emails and text messages, many would consider letter writing a lost art. But now it's finding new life among students with Greenville County Schools. For months, students at Washington Center have been communicating with student athletes who are now set to play in the SEC tournament in March. 7 News reporter Dave Jordan has the story. Now I'm just really, really excited about the opportunity to represent not only Vanderbilt, but, you know, women's basketball in the SEC. Look, there they are. There's the Commodores. Inside Ms. Cook's classroom at Washington Center, students are getting to know Marquise Webb, a forward with Vanderbilt University. Here's Ms. Marquise. It's one of the few times they've seen her speak, but they've been in touch with her since last fall. And it all began with this letter. She wrote back. Every answer and then more questions for us. She has, I need to know everyone's name, birthday, and our kids have jumped right in. This is part of a pen pal program Greenville County Schools implemented as part of the SEC Time Out in the Community initiative. Here at Washington Center, which teaches severely disabled students, 23 classrooms have communicated with an SEC athlete. Inside room 221, the class keeps score of Webb's wins and losses. Her letter is also on display. What do we say? You could see the excitement among Virginia Cook students who were all too eager to cheer on the Commodores and by extension, Webb. Go Commodores! Cook tells us Webb had an effect on her students. He asked if he could take his basketball with him outside and we have a small little basketball hoop and they now recognize what that is. Webb and her team will be in Greenville next month for the SEC tournament. A classroom visit is planned. In Greenville, Dave Jordan, 7 News. Isn't that cool? Look at what a letter can do, Gordon. Yeah, stay with us. 7 News at 6 starts right now.